want whatever you need. I'm 24 and I own a tattoo shop in San Diego. When I was 15 years old, I was signed uh, to a major label here in Los Angeles. My first record came out when I was 17 and, and finally the record company actually imploded and they don't exist anymore so I got kind of left. So I definitely feel that trying out for American Idol is like a second chance for me. You're coming back. Welcome to Hollywood, Carly! In Hollywood week, I definitely gave it my all and I really enjoyed it. You are in the top three best vocalists this year. When he said that, that was really cool because I guess in San Diego, I just didn't think he really liked me. The whole day of the final judgment, I was fine sitting there up until when Ryan came over to me. How important is this moment? How important is it for you to make it through? <laughs> it's really important. I want it more than anything. I'm just here to sing. I'm not here to be the diva or the prima donna or anything like that. I'm just here to be Carly and hopefully everybody likes it. So, man, that's what the show is all about. I hear you had bronchitis, had a cold, you're coughing, all of this nonsense, everybody's sick, this is the worst flu in history. Guess what? The best vocal of the last two days, the best vocal of the top 24 right there. Hot, hot, blazing hot. Sick is not an excuse. <laughs> you are the lucky coin in the pocket. You're reliable and I know how hard this week was for you, and I know it must have been scary, but you know what, Carly? It doesn't matter. You, you do not even have to power your voice. The tenderness of your voice, everything, every choice you make, the, in, nice, the right? beautiful inflections. Thank you. All, all right, Captain Fantastic. Come Sorry, on. once again, I'm on my own here, because of course. I just... <laughs> I, of course, I, I didn't of course. get it. Uh, you know, there's so much hype about you, and there's so much expectation. There yes, there is. I mean, there's a buzz about you. Oh, then that's a good thing. Do you want me to talk or not? No. <laughs> okay, that's true. Well, I'm going to. Um, I thought the song was way too old-fashioned for you. I even thought your mic technique was very cabaret. Everything about it, for me, was a letdown. And I know that you've got bronchi. I'm sorry. Oh, my sorry, but I, you know, I've sat here year after year when someone with your capabilities has come out and totally blown me away, whether it was Kelly or Fantasia, and I was genuinely expecting something fantastic. I didn't think it was fantastic. And if this was the first time I'd heard this girl, I wouldn't be jumping uh, up and down. Once again, uh, two against one. Uh, it was great. The mic technique. Ryan, let me just say something to Simon. The mic technique was that of a pro Bro, because she was belting pro. and she pulled it back so it didn't seem like it screamed. It yes. was brilliant. It was brilliant. All right, ladies and gentlemen.
gentlemen. Well, that's all right. Well, While Simon was, was talking to Carla, you were laughing off camera. What was uh, amusing you? Um, him talking about my technique. Yeah. I, I started doing this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so take note of that technique. All right.